Sure. Uh, yeah, I mean, sort of, um, you know, sort of story two tales. We had on the women's side where we did, we played really well. I mean, we really dug out some tough doubles matches and uh, got the sweep early on, and that propelled us for a clean sweep the whole match, you know, winning 9-0 against a team we lost to pretty easily last year. Um, you know, we, we played great. We played better than expected. Um, the men's side was a little different story. We, you know, like we knew we were going to be well, at, we were going to do well at, at one doubles, and we did. Uh, but two and three, you know, we just, you know, we were close. Games were close, but we couldn't pull out the games that went to deuce, couldn't convert uh, break points and game points. And, um, you know, that's why we lost two and three doubles uh, the way we did. And then, you know, so you, you go down into singles, down 2-1, and you put a little bit more pressure on yourself, and uh, things can snowball. And, unfortunately, that's what happened. And, um, you know, we had, you know, Brian played great at one again. He's on he's on an absolute tear, one in straight sets. Uh, Tony, unfortunately, didn't get to finish his match due to darkness, but was playing really well, was up a break in the second set. Um, Doug fought real well, had a really, really tough opponent. So, I mean, his his match certainly, that was, that was a tough match for him, um, but he fought hard. Um, yeah, but really, two and three doubles. We just that's that's the story of every loss we've had is just aren't doing well down the lineup in, in doubles, and um, we've got to start better. So if we're going to be right back to work. We know the things we need to correct. There, that has not changed uh, over the last few weeks, and we've got to work even harder and, and better at it uh, to make sure we don't keep repeating the same mistakes. Yeah. Um, well, I think for the guys, it's sort of gut check time. It's soul searching time. We've got a week before we go face another team that we played last year. Another that was a close match, even though we we won the match eight one. Um, and they're they're good. Shenandoah is a good team. So, I mean, the guys we have we have seven days to get corrected all the mistakes that we made. And um, you know, we've known what these things are for a few weeks, and we we've got to get it down. Um, the girls really. I mean, that that's this is a match that. I fully expect it to be extremely close, um, and it was in doubles, but singles we sort of ran away with it. We pulled out all the close matches, uh, and I think that's sort of you know a young team coming around. We had a lot of very tight matches, especially in singles last week in uh, in Hilton Head during spring break, and we weren't able to pull a lot of those out. We were I think one and four in, in, in third set tie breaks, uh, and we won two of them in third sets today. So I think we're sort of we're sort of turning the corner there on the women's side, and and you know we should feel real confident heading uh, next Friday's match against Shenandoah. I think, um, you know, obviously that's a quick turnaround. We go down to Virginia, play Shenandoah, and then the very next day, our first conference match here against Lycoming. And um, the whole, like, you know, like I've said all along, all these non-conference games are to prepare us for our conference, for that first match against Lycoming. Um, and we think, you know, we think Shenandoah is probably a really good uh, test for us. You know, we're, we're if we can hang with them, if we can beat them, um, then we should have all the confidence in the world that we're going to turn around the next day and do the same to Lycoming. Um you know, so the girls girls are riding high right now, and they, and they deserve it. Um, you know, the guys, we've we've got about half the team playing real well, and the other half has, has got to step it up. So we're still waiting for guys to step up. We're probably going to have to shake up two and three doubles a bit, um, make sure we get back to full strength, and um, you know, hopefully carry that to a win against Shenandoah.